Hello watch fans, Berth Year Watches here and this time we've got something a little unusual for us, this is our first West End Watch Company watch, this is a SOA, I may have mispronounced that but SOA means the, the cavalryman and West End Watch Co, quite an interesting company, I didn't really appreciate what they've done, they've been going since 1880, they were the biggest supplier of watches in India for quite a long time and uh, they supplied both the uh, railways in India, and you know how important railways are in India, and also the British Indian Army. In 1917, they registered SOA as the cavalrymen. They were supplying watches for World War I. So good history, and I, it had passed me by. Uh, they also had the license to produce or use movements from companies like Longines, so they were taken seriously. This has an ETA movement inside. We think it's from 1996-ish, but this movement was around for a little while. We could be a few years off on that quite easily. So lots going on. You've got this bezel, which is sitting behind the crystal, so it doesn't get the dirt. You've got cathedral hands and loomed numerals, and they do work quite well. The sower and the red second hand. And then you've got day and date on the calendar. And they can be set, quick set. So there's no messing around. Signed crown, original bracelet, and this watch has been worn. You can always tell on the bracelet clasp how much it's been worn because these are the bits that get the most wear and tear. So you can see it's not been worn much. Very very slight wear to the top of the case with the hooded lugs just where it's a little thin pro probably a little thin applied if anything and the date and date have uh, magnifiers on so unlike a Rolex with a Cyclops sticking up these sit underneath the glass so that's perfectly smooth but they do help just magnify the day and date make life a little easier so an interesting triple gold watch, lots going on, a little bit different, and available now at berthierwatches.com. Thanks for watching.